Now, civil society organizations, CSOs, that converge on Benin City, their doorstep capital, have warned that the current model of divestments by international oil companies operating in the Niger Delta will cause local communities to lose economic power. The Juju conclusion at a civil society roundtable on IOC divestment from the Niger Delta organized by the Environmental Right Action Friends of the Earth Nigeria. Some of those that spoke at the convening included Friday Ogeraki, former Edo State House of Assembly member, and Prince Babs Paworo, president of the host communities network of Nigeria. Ogeraki described the vestments by the ISIS as a strategy of using and dumping of the people of the oil bearing communities and their environments, adding that the decision of the oil firms to leave the region without remediating for oil pollution was tantamount to sucking the juice from a fruit and leaving the chaff behind. In a similar vein, Paworo noted that the joint venture agreement between the Nigerian government and the IOCs is better described as profit sharing without accountability and responsibility to the local communities. Earlier, Area 4 and Executive Director Chima Williams said that the roundtable on investment was a continuation of a process that they had commenced to interrogate the reasons the IOCs suddenly started uh, the investment process. Children state must cease for the incentivization of the oil companies to divest from onshore and invest in deep offshore. If there should be an incentive for such investment, should be that there is already a guaranteed process of reclaiming our environment and restoring it to what it was before these divesting entities began operations. We have always known that perhaps what drives the oil economy in Nigeria is profit. Profit, profit and profit. Not the people. Not how the people will benefit from what ordinarily is a God-given blessing. So there is no community problems. No government policy. There are government agents. The PRO is not there. So when they get on the deep offshore, they just do business the way they want to do business. And they have destroyed the environment, destroy everything. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.